What we're seeing today is a continuation of extremely low inventory. So as a buyer today, there are three things you're probably going to have to do if you want to purchase a property. Number one, you've got to be prepared to pay over list price. You're going to probably have to make an appraisal gap coverage. And number three, and this is something that people are starting to do, uh, I'm, I'm not a big advocate of this, but they're actually waiving building inspections and giving free possession after closing to the seller. All these things to make you know, your offer look as good as possible for the seller. Now to give an idea of how, uh, how low the inventory is in Ann Arbor, if we go to Burns Park, for instance, there are five active listings, four are over a million. Angel School has got only one house for sale. If I look in the three hundred dollars to $500,000 price range, which is sort of in Ann Arbor, is the beginning home buyer price range, there are 71 properties listed, but only 11 of them are active. Everything else is under contract. In the total Ann Arbor marketplace, there's only 46 houses available. And of those 46, 13 are priced over a million. So it just shows you how, how scant the inventory is once you start getting in the lower price points. So the big question buyers always ask is like, you know, should I be buying a house today? And you know, it's always a good time to buy a house if you plan on staying there for a while. So if you're going to be in your house, you think for 10 years, this is the time to buy. In even the worst depression, 10 years would have corrected all the losses. So if you have any questions about the market niche that you're living in or you're interested in possibly buying or selling, feel free to give us a call and you can reach me here at the office at 734-761-3060. If you're enjoying this content and like what you see, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook.